Hello and welcome to Fashion Report Friday, the weekly video series trying to get you the most MGP humanly possible from the Mandeville Gold Saucer every week on a Friday when judging begins on the Fashion Report minigame. This is week 268 and the theme is Winter Drape Walkie Bug. The individual clues for items include Drapes of Wrath for our chest, Shivering Timbers for your legs, Winter Wonderland for your feet, and your left ring is a bone to pick. In this video, you have a 100 score, an 80 with dies, and the easiest 80 possible. Without further ado, for the 100, I went for the Vath Thorax. This is something that can be obtained from the Vath Tribal Quest back in Heavenswood for 130,000 gil and 9 black copper gil, which is the currency for that tribe. Alternatively, the Nath and um, uh, the Nath Thorax will work as well, which is the other chess piece. And I believe the Cauldron King or Augmented Cauldron King's coat should work as well. However, I am not sure at this point. For our legs then, I went for the Pagos Gaskins. These are obtainable from Pagos Lockboxes from Eureka Pagos, or alternatively, you can get this on the market board. These are especially good because they're equipable by everybody in the game. Alternatively, the Arachne Gaskins of Striking or Scouting should work, the Kiramu Brace, and the Griffin Leather Brace of Striking and Scouting should also work for gold this week. For the boots then, I went for the Highland Boots. Up until this point, I'm not sure if there are any other alternatives, but this is a fairly simple craft with Leather Worker, or alternatively, go to your market board. This is because it matches the Winter Wonderland clue, and I'm not sure about recommending anything else at this point. If you do have any suggestions for alternatives, leave those in the comments. And then finally, for our left ring or ring slot, I went with the Bone Ring. This is one of the easier options to pick up this week. Uh, you can go over to any of your low-level sort of vendors, um, such as Lolnu, next to the um, the Gwalter NPC that I usually use in the Steps of Thal. You can get this for 132 gil. Alternatively, you can craft this with Goldsmith. There are great alternatives to this, but there are too many to list, some of which are the Coral Ring, the Red Coral Ring, and the Horn Ring. All of those will work. But again, the Bone Ring, acquired from a vendor, accessible to everybody, usable by everybody, why wouldn't you go for it? So the 100's not too bad this week. However, I would say that they could have broadened things out a bit, especially with the chess piece, but uh, it is what it is. For our maximum MGP then, all we need to do is get 80 score. So let's look at an 80 with dies. The dies this week aren't terribly bad. We've got Honey Yellow times three. So that includes any weapon in the game, any head in the game, and any hands in the game dyed honey yellow. Any chest in the game dyed gunmetal black, which is slightly disappointing. And the legs and feet both wrapped a blue dye. The gunmetal black will cost you 500 Sky Builder scripts, or another way of you getting it is from the market board. Um, so you're going to have to shop around for that one if you want to go for the dyes. But the other dyes are really good. The blue and yellow specifically, um, really useful. Knowing what we have learned then into an easy 80 of a week, there are many ways of doing this. One of the ways is to combine the bone ring and the Pegos Gaskins. Uh, that will get you an 80 score guaranteed as long as you have something equipped in every slot of your gear. Another way of doing it then would be to combine your dies. For example, you could go for your bone ring from a vendor and then dye any of your weapon, head or hands, honey yellow in the game. That should work. Or you could dye any legs in the game, any feet in the game wrapped to blue with your, I don't know, your hands, honey yellow, whilst also equipping that bone ring. And you should be able to get it. Mixing and matching between um, should work absolutely fine. So just do whatever is more accessible to you. Uh, put an FC buff on, for example, and you will get more than your base MGP as well. Much love. Enjoy the rest of your day. There will be a link in the description where this is theorized, and uh, I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.